All right, good morning, everyone. Well, it's good morning here, and we are going to have breakfast. My breakfast meal today is also going to be my pre-workout meal. And today we're going to train legs this, uh, after we eat. So this breakfast will be a little larger than usual for me. We want to start off with some eggs here. So we're going to get the skillet warmed up. Um, here are the eggs I use. We typically go to a farm and get our eggs, but we, we ran out. So I went to the grocery store yesterday and I picked these up. We're going to cook with some coconut oil. I like to cook on medium heat. That's good. So that was just a that was just a little bit to coat the skillet. Now I'm just going to drop two eggs in here. Sometimes we whisk them up and make them scrambled. Today I'm just going to drop them in here. And as you can see, they're cooking up fast. So we're going to let that cook. I'm going to go ahead and throw some sourdough toast in the toaster. The other thing I'm going to do is throw some coffee in. Donut shop is what I have today. Coffee in here. I'm going to put my special mug in here. And I'm going to put about eight ounces of water. Okay. And that's good to go. Looks like our eggs are almost done. I am going to flip them over one time. That's good. Now the toast is done. So you want to use my Kerrygold Pure Irish Butter. All right. So I'm going to throw the uh, eggs on here. So I leave the yolks, if you can see, look how orange they are, first of all. Those are really good quality eggs, from, especially from a store. They're a little tiny bit runny, which I like. And also for my eggs, I like to put pink Himalayan sea salt on my eggs. So I'm going to be adding this as well. I do like to use a little bit of Truvia and my coffee. So I'll put a little Truvia in there. So that's gonna be the majority of the breakfast. I'm gonna make one more thing because again, I need some extra calories today. So this is like, you're probably wondering, well, that's a pretty small meal in of itself. And this is what I would normally eat. I'm eating more for maintenance these days. Um, if I were trying to, like if, you, if we did this video 10 years ago, that probably would have been six eggs or at least four eggs. Um, I used to eat a lot of oatmeal, but I don't tend to eat as much oatmeal anymore. It just tends to bloat me a little bit. Uh, usually when I have this breakfast here, uh, I feel awesome. If I go with a bigger br breakfast, I tend to feel kind of lethargic, and sometimes I'll even get sleepy and I'll want to fall back to sleep. So this for me is really good. Again, if you're a young lad and you're wanting to pile in a lot of muscle, you probably want to have some more eggs. You want to bump up the calories some, but this is really good for me. So we're gonna add some extra calories today. This is um, a company called Pride Foods. They make this rice and grinds, this cream of rice. If you've followed me, you know that I'm a big believer in cream of rice, particularly pre-workout. So I'm gonna use a quarter cup in there. A half a cup of water will make it kind of pasty. And if you use a full cup of water, it's kind of runny. So you just make it to how the, you want the texture to be. So if you put a full cup of water in there, it's gonna be pretty runny. A half a cup is gonna be like a paste. So I'm gonna do about three quarters of a cup. All right, so just pour it in there. I microwave it for 50 seconds. All right, so now I put in a little peanut butter. I would use almond butter, but almond butter annoys me because of the texture, it gets like a block and it doesn't mix real well. 
Then I'm going to stick in some Hershey's sugar-free syrup. It does have some sugar alcohol in it, but a little bit is not going to kill you. Okay, now I made mine a little bit runnier in texture, but you can make it as thick as you want. Usually, I don't know why this is, but usually if, if, if I were to be dieting for a contest, I prefer to be it really thick like a paste. I don't know why, um, but I just like it when it's like chunks, it's so thick. So I don't use much water when I'm dieting, but I'm not dieting, so I like it runny. This is called the concoction bowl. This is a very easy to digest pre-workout meal. You could eat it post-workout. Very, very easy on the stomach. So that's it. So let's chow down. Again, this is a pretty big meal by my standards. I hope you'll give this breakfast a shot. I think you'll enjoy it. And as always, make sure you click on the link below to subscribe.